Now let's talk music a little bit. What do you hate the most about the music industry? Go first. Man, what I hate the most about the mu music industry is it comes, it's missing something. It's missing the culture, man. Like, you gotta preserve the culture, man. Like, back in the day when LL Cool J, Will Smith dropped, you heard that clean, smooth guy on that intercom talking to the students. That's A1. We smooth enough to go through your intercom and talk to your students and tell them how to get a dollar, save a dollar. It's just like when you grew up, Smalls. You know, like when you was riding in the car with your parents, you ain't used to hear all the cursing like how you might hear on the radio nowadays. A1 just tried to take you back to that time, but with the 2016 flavor, you know what I'm saying? We just try to mix a little old with a little new, you know? Because I know when I grew up, I ain't hear no cursing on the radio. But now you can say whatever. Whatever. But I'm not knocking nobody, Definitely. but to each his own. A1, see, we had, to, we had to choose this route because in our city, if we if we just rap like everybody else, we wouldn't stand out. And that's something we got to do. We had to stand out to separate ourselves. And people notice. People actually notice. When you see our videos, it's A1. Mm -hmm. When you hear the song, it's A1. You know what I'm saying? When we pull up. A1. When we leave. A1. Chicks, A1. Everything. So do you curse in your music at all, or it's just to a minimum? Go ahead and answer that. No cursing. No cursing. Just try to keep it clean. We got a song. Clean. Check us out. Hey, that thing doing numbers. Numbers. Clean. That video about to drop. That's going on World Star. Y'all look out. We got one locked and loaded right now. <laughs> <laughs> hey, it's right in the iPhone. Boom. <laughs> Upload real soon. Don't never think A1 ain't got tracks. If you think what you see is, is it, man, please. Y'all boy better get some tracks. Stop piling music. And get your song mixed and mastered. <laughs> now what about the N-word? What's your stance on the N-word as far as your music, rap music? Mm -hmm. I feel like that should stay with the culture, man. We all know what that means. But you know, that's your culture. The N word, like, we don't use it in the music. You know, might be, I'm honest, you know what I'm saying? If I'm kicking it with bruh, my homeboys, you know, I might say it, but uh, nah, that need to stay within us. Don't know other race need to be saying it. That's just disrespectful. I don't care on what platform you're on, it's just disrespectful. But I don't, I'll try not to use it. Is it hard to make music without using the N-word or cursing? I'm gonna be honest, it's a true story. When we first started, we was going hard, cursing, going hard. But bro was like, nah, nah, it's not gonna work. It's not gonna work, we gotta separate ourselves. And I'm like, what? Nah, man, I'm a rapper, you know what I'm saying? I got a freedom of speech, you know what I'm saying? I got a Say how I feel. I quit. I put it down for some weeks, man. But sitting home and doing nothing and people dying and going to jail, man, I picked it up and really put my mind to use. It's a lot of words you can use without cursing. How many words is it in the world? It's a thick dictionary. And how many curse words is it? Small. So you just got to use your mind. Definitely. Think outside the box. It was just a proposal I had to coming up and uh, attacking this industry, man. Like, we ready to go. You want to put me on the radio? You ain't got to edit nothing. I went ahead and handled that for you. <laughs> Told y'all. I handled it, man. That's what type of student I was. Yeah, I'm, man. This man, college degree, man. This man, yeah. Hey, we gonna get it done. Now, do people, when they listen to your music for the first time or get into your music, do they notice you don't curse? Or... 
They What's act, the reaction? They actually don't. Well, some people don't, but some do. So it's we get a mix, you know. We get a mix. Definitely, they understand. They, they, they really don't say nothing about it. Like, every every bar is so clear that you know it. You know it. You know like, these boys ready. You know I'm ready already. You know I'm about to take off. You know it when you hear it. 